Hey guys, Frost here, and today I'm going to show you how to turn this dead corpse back into a living, breathing ragdoll. But first, I'm going to tell you about Bob. Now, Bob here, he's our janitor. You know, he cleans up uh, the messes after our, um, our experiments. We love Bob, and we pay him well with a great bounty of five chicken nuggies every day. But sadly, Bob just owes someone a bit of money, so, you know, they had to do, uh... Yeah, anyways, now since we, uh, we can't really clean without Bob, we're now gonna bring him back to life. So, first step, um... Just gonna... Uh, ignore that. First off, uh, we need to just check to see if there's still a pulse in him. Because who knows, he might be, even though he's been shot a few times. But it's fine, it's fine. Do not worry about it. So first off, um, you don't have to do this. Um, this is just to see that he is dead. So first things first, what you want to do is uh, you want to hook up this, uh, I don't know. It's just a machine that makes their heart pump automatically with... Out of, you know, being alive. So now their hearts will. Well, you see here, now here's a small little problem. Um, <laughs> they seem to be still dead. Uh, that means I probably inserted it wrong. Uh, no. Okay, I'm just dumb. So, here's how we do it. So, first things first, what you're gonna wanna do is you wanna go grab some, uh, some of this. Uh, I don't know how to say this correctly, Co coagulation, syringe, whatever, who cares. Um, you're just gonna jab it in there with, uh, you know, without care in the world. Then you wanna get mending. Alright, so then after that, once you have mending, um, you want, so as you can see, mending, now the heart's alive, that's a good step, but the rest of the body, it's kinda fucked. So we're gonna fix that. So first things first, well, this ain't the first thing. We already went through the first thing, but that doesn't matter. Just ignore what I said. <laughs> um, we're just gonna have to pump some blood into the body so he can, I don't know, exist, probably. But yeah. All right, so first let's just get us blood and then pump him full of that same blood. And see, now he's becoming alive again. Isn't this great? Don't we love... Don't we all just love it when a plan works? But as you can see, um, if you turn off the machine, he kind of starts dying. And very slowly. But there is a way to fix this. Um, there, first off, I want to say this one thing right before we get to that. Is if you want to fully heal them, you're going to need a bit of mending. It's, it's pretty much required if you want to fully heal. I guess, if that's what you wanted, if that's what you're going for. So let's take out this first. Um, I don't know why he's doing that. But what you're going to need to do is, if you want to bring them all the way back alive and get them off this machine, you're just going to need a defibrillator. That's really it. Alright. So now once we take them off. Alright. Give me a second. Turns out I missed a bit. Oh, <laughs> there we are. Now, as you can see, he's back alive and all the way. Now, if there's still problems, I suggest you just leave the mending syringe in. And as you can see, it works pretty rather well. He's already healing, as you could tell. Well, not as fast as you would expect, sadly, but he's still healing. And in no time, Bob will be back on his feet, ready to clean up the messes that he made. Bob sadly now has to go, because he is needed elsewhere in the facility, so therefore, we're just gonna, we're just gonna help him quicken the pace, so, bye Bob, thank you for your service, and have a great day. There he goes. What a brave lad, Bob. Wait, Bob, you're supposed to go the other, Bob. Bob, you're supposed to go over the thing, you're supposed to clean over it. Anyways, that's what that wraps up this video. So if you guys enjoyed, make sure to 
subscribe. Uh, I have a Twitch channel over on twitch.tv slash frostsorcerer. I'll leave a link in the description, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!